Good morning, Sun Coast, and thank you for watching this video for your weather update. We have a lot to talk about. It's going to feel warm and it's going to feel hot inland today with more 90s there, more 80s on the coast, warm and dry over the weekend, and then starting to increase our moisture early next week and even increasing our chance for some rainfall. For today, mostly sunny with a high of 86 inland showers. So that might give you a little bit of relief from the heat, but if they're as quick as yesterday's inland showers, then it's just really going to increase humidity there. Evening temperatures in the 60s or excuse me in the 70s with overnight lows in the upper 60s somewhat humid out there tomorrow afternoon 86 degrees inland showers possible winds from the southwest at 5 to 10 miles per hour. So there's your potential for some inland showers. Again, along the coast, looks like for you folks there, Venice, Bradenton, Sarasota is going to be a bit drier. Future track going into tomorrow shows the same possibility, but as we've seen for most of the week, most of us are just going to enjoy a lot of sunshine there. What we are going to see, though, going into next week is a big change in our pattern as an upper level trough shifts east and this ridge that has been keeping things warm shifts to the east. So we're looking at some cooler temperatures by late next week and an increased chance for rainfall as well. We'll also get the winds picking up associated with the front. You can see here in the blues, that's where we're seeing the pickup in winds as this front pushes to the south. And so do expect up breezier conditions by maybe around Wednesday, if not Thursday and Friday. Your full seven day forecast, 20% chance for showers the next couple of days. Again, mostly inland. And then Wednesday, I'm looking at a more uh, at a higher chance for rainfall there. We'll also take the temperatures down and maybe Thursday night even get some cooler overnight lows.